you're about to pick up a pair of these, you gotta make sure it's not a counterfeit. Even though a seller may claim to offer glasses that meet the international safety standards for solar filters, anyone can just slap a code on their product without actually testing it. The American Astronomical Society recommends against buying from whichever vendor offers the lowest price on sites like Amazon and Temu. Instead, making sure the supplier or manufacturer is identified on the AAS site's list of verified dealers and manufacturers is the way to go. You can also check local libraries, museums, and other community centers that might be handing them out for free. Never rely on sunglasses. No matter how dark they are, they won't be dark enough to protect your eyes properly. Staring at the sun, even if it's cloudy outside, without the proper protection can burn your retina. If you're in the path of totality for the eclipse, there's a small window where it's safe to take off your eclipse glasses and look directly at it when the moon entirely covers the sun. Go to NASA's interactive eclipse map to find out precisely when that will be for you.